everybody out there in YouTube land. So we are back. Sorry about the lighting there. The sun is behind the electrical post there, so it's making a shadow. But I'd like to keep working. So what we're going to do next is get all the wires for this done and then get it attached before we put in the bulkhead so that we can run the wires behind it and then we'll do the math step so for this plug you gotta have a little teeny screwdriver and you take out this small screw right here and this black piece pops out and then you can connect the wires I can't do it one handed so I'm gonna get that black piece out and then I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So once you get that little screw removed, you just push, whoo, it went flying. And then this comes out. The ground has a bigger hole than the rest, so it's easy to tell. And then there's little screws that you loosen and then you just connect the wires. So it's pretty simple. And then once you get all the wires connected, you just push it back up in here and then tighten the screw and you're good to go. So I'm going to get all the wires connected and then I'll be back. All right, I am back. So we have all the wires in the plug. So next, all you have to do is slip this on and then re-put in the screw so I'm gonna get the little screw in and then we'll pre-drill the holes here and I'll seal it all up with some 3m 4000 UV I don't have to pre-fill the holes with epoxy and then drill them again because this is all basically epoxy and new fiberglass here so it's not gonna get into the core when we did it, the hole was huge when we started. So, I'm going to get the little screw in there, and then I'll get these holes drilled and get it put down. And then I'll be back and show you what it looks like. Alright, we got it done and all sealed <clears throat> and screwed on. So, there's the little cap. And it's good to go till we get the mast on and plug her in. So next, I'm going to head down into the cabin. And we'll get to putting in the bulkhead. So I'm going to head on down there and I'll be back. All right, we are back inside and we have the bulkhead in. As everything in the boat, it doesn't always go to plan. I couldn't fit the wires back behind there and slide it over and get it tight enough. So I had to chisel out a little bit of this, uh, what would you call it, trim kind of thing. So the wires would fit and then the bulkhead could get in there tight enough. So I'm going to screw the bulkhead all in and then I'll do some wire things and we'll just run it on this side. I was hoping I'd be able to hide it, but oh well. It'll still work wonderfully. So I'm going to get the bulkhead secured in and then I'll get these wires all wire tied up and I'll be back. All right, we are back. Everything is nice and secured. All I have left to do is run the wires with some wire ties and that part will be done. And then next we'll head up on the top side and we'll put on the mass, the new mass step. So I'm gonna get these wires all up with some wire holders and I'll be back and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, everybody, we are back. So we are up top side. I got the holes pre-drilled. Next, I'm gonna use my countersink bit and we'll give it a little bit of a countersink so that the sealant will have something to go down in and then I'll get the new mass step and I'll be back. All right, so we have the new mass step and the new mass step base so that you can hook up pulleys 
to run all the lines to the back cockpit. So the front ones, we're going to go all the way through and then put washers on the back so that I can run a wire on the back of the bolt down to the plate on the bottom of the boat for grounding if the mast ever gets hit with uh, lightning. And then on the back two here, we're just going to do two little bolts so that if the mast ever does de-step or break, hopefully it won't rip up the whole ceiling. It'll just pull that up. So I'm going to get it all 3 m and secure and I'll be back all right everybody out there in YouTube land so we have it all secured down we did it replaced the mast electrics redid the bulkhead underneath and put in a new mast step and mast plate if you guys have any questions about the process, leave it in the comments below. Hit that like button and subscribe. It helps us out. I'll see you guys later.